Hey guys, welcome to Offshoot Comics Off Topic. We're your host, Kirby Kid. And Black Superman. Also known as David Clark. And Walter Bryant. Today we're talking about Naruto chapter 671. Yeah, okay, so Naruto um, 671. Naruto's talking to the to the sage of Six Pass. And we discover that, uh, well, the entire history of the ninja world has basically boiled down to two factors. Um, brothers hate each other and parents can't be parents. Awful parenting. Awful. That that is the message to take away from the entire Naruto series. Be a good parent, or your child will try to take over the giant or the world, the giant tree. <laughs> so a giant tree. That will yeah. happen. That will happen for sure. <laughs> and there's no way around it if you're a bad parent. Oh, and also, um, Eve wasn't the only woman out there who did terrible things for the world. There's also uh, yeah. She ate an apple. They became a death god. It looked like, like she looked like the, like the death god. She really did, with, and then she became evil, and also had ears. a Bjorn gun. She had a Bjorn gun, apparently. But she's but she's got bunny ears. How are you evil with bunny ears? You can't be evil with bunny. A woman ears. can. A woman can. A woman can. They can. They can be evil with anything. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, um, so yeah, so she, so she had a Bjorn gun, and then she was evil, and then I guess she had two sons. We found out last chapter. Uh huh. Um, they never talk about the other one, which probably caused a war. Because he's like, why don't y'all talk about me? I'm so sad and evil. Oh, my God. Yeah, and then the other one was, you know, the sage. And, and awesome. Awesome, yeah. And then we also find out that the sage was having this conversation with both Naruto and Sasuke at the same time. And Sasuke is somehow, I guess, like, oh, yeah, I want to be a good guy and love me and give me power. No one. I don't know. He just came to that conclusion. He just... Except Naruto had nine beasts somehow still inside of him. Yeah, and, um, well, let's see. Okay, last week we were discussing the fact that, uh, that Sasuke couldn't be the reincarnation of the older brother, and it right. turns out that Sasuke is the reincarnation of the older brother. Right, brother, so. but, like, if he's the reincarnation, then how does him and Madara being alive at the same time work? Oh, it's simple. Um, and, and that's how that works. Oh, okay, so, so it's, like, step one... Both be alive. Step two, question mark. Step three, profit. <laughs> yeah, pretty much, pretty much. Okay, this is um, a hole. This is this is a plot hole. You can't be reincarnated in two people at once. Oh, you could. No, one can be reincarnated in half of her soul can take it and put it into someone else. Yeah, I mean, you know, Kagome and what, what was Kikyo. her name? Kikyo, yeah. They, they, uh... They had the same thing happen. That was different. They though. shared that, a soul. Yeah, like that. Like she was alive because it was her turn, and then they cut off a part of her soul or some kind of voodoo and, magic and, and brought her Kikyo, back. Yeah, but Kikyo eventually gave part of her stuff back. That's all I remember. Yeah, when when the big hole. Was right. Put yeah, she's like, place. here, here's some stuff that I took from you, which you took from me. Um. So yeah, like like that. They acknowledged that this one. They're like, oh yeah. So they're both the reincarnation of the older brother and both alive, and no one is feeling any side effects from anything. Yeah, because they're awesome like that. I mean, oh, and the first is back. Well, yeah. Who's also Naruto? So yeah, but see, he's dead. I, no, but his soul is present. <laughs> yeah, but it's dead. His though. soul is present, but it's dead. Wait a minute. Hold on. Another 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 pothole. Okay, if Naruto is the reincarnation of the of the younger brother, and so is the first Okage. What happened to Naruto's soul when the first Okage was in the Death God's stomach, which is technically, I, I, I'm assuming, his grandmother's spirit. Because they look exactly alike. It left. From the Death God. Because souls do that. Yeah, okay, so here's what, we, here's what we've discovered. Um, we do some writing. We, we feel like we're pretty good at it. And one of the things that we do before we decide to um, okay a story is go back and fact check ourselves. I don't think he actually went back and fact checked anything. I think he just said, this is how it is. This is my story. Get over it. I mean, it'd be like, like what if, what if, what if uh, Korra actually met Aang? Like, not spirit realm, like, met Aang. Someone using dark magic brings Aang back that can't work because because Korra is Aang Aang is Korra as sad as that is 
<laughs> so you just broke my heart a little I, bit. I know, I'm sorry. Okay. They are the same person. <laughs> this one was really good and the other one was Korra. Uh, <laughs> so you got Naruto and Sasuke being the older and younger brother, but also the other people who are the older and younger brother are currently present. You can't both be two things. That doesn't make any sense. I owe Brainy an apology. Hmm. Oh, you, you can be wrong on your own story. You are wrong, Kishimoto. <laughs> this don't make no sense. And Brady, you were right. We were we were wrong on that one. And the mm-hmm. demons being like, oh, hey, it's the old man. Let's all be nice. No, how about the times when you were murdering people? Remember when you were bundles of hate for about 10 million years? Yeah. We're not going to forget that because it's been like five minutes and now you're on our side because it benefits you because you don't want to be part of a giant tree again. Well, actually, yes, we will forget that. No, we will really we, won't. We will forget that we tried to that Sasuke tried to assassinate the no. Hokage. We no. will forget that um, that. Well, let's see. It's like with the, it's like Vegeta. Oh, you're you're cool with us now. Really, remember the first time he came to Earth? Remember that? Remember that? That little. Yeah, but he fell in love with Bulma. No. Yeah, and, and no, being, sir. Being in love with Bulma made it better. You know, first of all, first actually, of all, I'm surprised Gar became Kazakage. That didn't make no dang sense. Well, they were afraid of him. Oh, well, maybe that, yeah. Fear I, does <laughs> make you want to vote for the guy. <laughs> but it's like, you can't just be all puppy dog people now. And first of all, I don't know how the Sage Six Path is like still just like chilling in hyperspace or whatever. Just. Well, yeah, but I mean, you know, he said that he actually got reef constituted because they they put the first and. But no, but, he, but he's saying that he's been watching his, kill, his kids kill each other for a long time. Well, he's yeah. been doing it. So, but here's the thing, though. Like, he says he's powerless to do anything right, by the right, because he's dead. But like, if he he's so powerless that he's about to give Sasuke and Naruto power. You understand that? He can't do anything. He can't like apparently he can just sit there for all the time and look at people, and can't. But he can't step out into the world and do something. But he's about to step kind of into the world and do something. Well, no, no. He's going to attach his power. Two people who can step out into the but world. But then, like, couldn't he then just, like, through that power, like, re-bring himself out? Because, like, yo, kids can do it. Could, can't you do it? So, you're saying, like, bring let, back let, to let Naruto and Sasuke become the Wonder Twins and they put their fists together. And, and then he'll be like, ha I was kidding, I'm back. <laughs> <laughs> I'm actually super evil. Ha <laughs> you get stupid. <laughs> I made the Nine-Tail Fox. You think I'm a good guy? Come on. <laughs> well, he did. He, he actually did look pretty evil when you first get a look at him. Well, because he has horns. Because they're freaks, they're they're genetic freaks, and they should be destroyed. <laughs> but yeah, okay. So, and I don't I don't know what they said to Sasuke. Uh, I'm sure something about your brother was I don't know stupid. I, I don't care. Um, I just it pains me to have been right this time. I mean, you understand this? It, right? it didn't make no sense. Like like it, it pains me to have been right. They, they should have just retconned Naruto having an older brother somewhere. Just like, just like he should have, this older brother should have just popped up and been like, hey, I'm the older brother, ha. Or maybe Kishimoto, for once in your life, stop doing parallels and bonds and everyone being just like Naruto. Because every time there's an enemy, they talk, and Naruto goes, in this exact way, he looks down and goes, he's just like me. I'm so sad. <laughs> you can be a better person. Why? Because I said you can be a better person. I have no factual basis for what I'm saying, but just believe in what I'm saying and it'll work. And we yeah. all like each other. Oh, no, sorry, no, no. We're all like Naruto. He has special there's, bases. There's no other parallels for anybody else. So basically, Sasuke sucks. Yeah, that's, yeah. Well, uh, yeah, that's, that's the main message of all shoot comics. <laughs> yeah, well, <laughs> Sasuke sucks and Cyclops sucks. Cyclops. I haven't said that in a really long Cyclops time. Cyclops sucks. So, yeah, that's... Him and Sasuke both suck as a unit. But they should yeah. like put, we should put them together and like, <laughs> in like a, in a game or something and, and just be like except though like where Cyclops looks at fighting Sasuke's actually pretty good at fighting he would kill him like he, he's actually a good fighter we just hate it as a person yeah and <laughs> Cyclops has awesome powers and mm. can't use them he, they're all I mean they're they're not even like real like Superman lasers they're like hey here's this red thing that can hurt you it can push you he can put a but he can put a hole through a mountain so can a lot can, of things well yeah like the juggernaut <laughs> The Juggernaut, the Hulk. the Hulk, weapons we have today in real life. Speaking of the Hulk, mm. did you see the last Avengers symbol? No, but I saw Hulk and the Agents of Smash. Which every time I see it, I get I have less respect for the Hulk. 
which must be how you felt when you saw Superman Returns. Oh God, Hulk and Agents of Smash. Okay, I, I have to give. I have to have this rant. Okay. Okay. There's this episode where they are fighting their jet, and the jet is kicking the crap out of the Hulk. Have you seen this episode? Yes, they're fighting the jet. The leader gives the jet like like uh, a, a an actual brain or something, and the jet is kicking the crap out of them. Okay, the jet flies out into space, and all the hulks these are hulks these are hulks they can they can lift like planets. As this jet is flying into space, they fall down, and the Hulk says, "G forces pinning me down." The Hulk. Listen to what I just said to you. The Hulk is pinned down by the g-forces of a jet going fast his own jet which kicked the crap out of him on the moon i cannot make a face that shows more disapproval than what i'm doing right now this that's is, too bad because it's not enough <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's, it's not a, it's, it's not enough <laughs> anger and disappointment and appointment and understand, Superman is my favorite superhero. I love the Hulk, but Superman is my favorite superhero. But I'm sitting there watching this and thinking to myself, Superman would trash this Hulk. Wolverine would trash that Hulk. Yeah. I mean, it's just... It's just factually wrong. g Force just can't pin the Hulk down. Okay, 11 times gravity. Okay. The Hulk weighs 1,500 pounds, so 11 times that is, what, 165? I don't know. To, uh, that's 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 165,000 pounds. Okay, that's 80 tons. Or, eight, or, yeah, like 80 tons. The Hulk, his upward limit when he's not angry is like 100,000 tons. Remember... Why the, is this a problem? Remember the first episode of uh, Earth's Mightiest Heroes, the greatest com- cartoon showing of the Avengers ever? Where in the very first episode, Graviton, Graviton was all like crushing the Earth. And Hulk was like, "Yeah, that's cute. Let me just jump up in the sky real quick and dunk in your face." Yeah, you remember that? Yeah, remember that Hulk. Yeah, this is not that Hulk. This is not that guy. No, this it's is a different really, banner. This is really not. Th- this is like Wendy Banner. He like, he's like, <laughs> "Hey guys, I want to be the Hulk today." No, and then they have weapons. Okay, I understand, Jen. Using weapons, I, I I get Red Hulk using weapons because that's what he's been doing his entire life. Yeah, I don't get the Hulk using a weapon. He's not nearly refined enough to use weapon. Yeah, and it's like a it's like a it shoots gamma rays from a wrist gauntlet or something. Is it's bad. It's just bad. I mean, and every time I think maybe there's something redeeming going to happen, it gets worse. It's like the campiest. It's like a 1970s cartoon. I mean, it is. It's like really, really campy. They, the Hulk has got weapons, which he, I'm only he, assuming they gave them. Golf, so that he wore golf shorts, dude, and a tuxedo, yeah, a yeah, white tuxedo. Yeah, but you were saying though, you were saying it's like it's like they put all this crap on them just so they can sell toys. Which, by the way, I haven't seen any toys of. Just say it. So look, they'll probably cancel the show because they didn't make toys. But here's the thing: though. if you're going to give the Hulk that's a okay, weapon, then. yeah, that's yeah. okay. If you're going to give the Hulk a weapon. Give him like a little vest thing that shoots gamma rays that that's fueled from him, so that he's got a laser beam that freaking gets more and more powerful. That makes sense. Not like a little Iron Man choo choo choo. No no no. Give him something that taps into his rage. I say give him the Planet Hulk outfit and a big battle axe. That works. Yeah, but, th- but there's no energy. Who cares? It's he the Hulk. Tap with, into it. It's the Hulk with a battle give axe. Give him some rage, man. <laughs> That's the one thing he needs. Why? It's because he will look cool. It is the Hulk imagine, with a battle axe. Imagine like. him holding that battle axe, yelling at the sky with a giant energy beam coming out like of his eyes or his mouth or his the chest. So take a plug and like tie a little thing to his chest or something mm-hmm. and then plug the battle axe in and make him able to toss gamma rays. Like giant Gatuga Tenchos? Yeah. Except his will do something? This. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Seriously, Kasuga Tensho and Bleach was like a kunai in Naruto. It does nothing and it's all there for show. But the ultimate Kasuga Tensho. First does. of all, shouldn't have done anything. It was just a giant slice. And all of a sudden, Mr. Immortal can't be destroyed. He's like, I'm somehow destroyed long enough for you to use this complicated seal. Oh, now I'm in jail. <laughs> really? Yeah, okay. Really? Man. So his ultimate power was to cut you down like, like Kenpachi's Bankai, which is just use two hands? <laughs> And now you can't. <laughs> what? 
<laughs> There's so many bad writers today. Speaking of it's that. so bad. That is, I think, like the most frustrating thing about Naruto. Everybody he goes up against, what is it? They, 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 all, have, they all have something in common. They're, they're all, all bad pass. Yeah. And then they're like, oh, you know what? Instead, of, the Bleach, Bleach has the same cop out. Instead of the ultimate battle where, you know, I kick the crap out of you and that's why I'm the hero, they all just go, oh, I was a bad guy. I don't want to be a bad guy anymore. Well, I, Aizen, Aizen at the end sort of was hinting at the fact that he was doing what he was doing because the Soul King is evil, which is kind of interesting. But then I think Kubo found out he was canceled and he's like, you know what? I don't care. No, you don't get that story. <laughs> Instead, <laughs> you get... Quincy's that for some reason, even though I told you they only had arrow powers, they now have I don't know bonkais and other bull crap, and they can steal your bonkai, and they have yeah. all these different and varied powers. And they're humans who can just walk into the social. And they just be doing stuff like one, like the guy he's fighting right now, like Kimachi's fighting. His power is anything he thinks of happens. That's not a Quincy power. That has <laughs> never been a Quincy power. That's a lie. That's lies and slander. Well, I mean, or he may kind of can do that. No, but she's not a Quincy. She doesn't come from a Maybe family. Maybe she is. No, no, no. no. But, uh, she comes from. She doesn't come from a long line of people who only do this. Maybe she does. No, she doesn't. Maybe well, apparently, her I mean, power came from Ichigo. Apparently, Ichigo does. That's so she. So she's got a Quincy power. See? No. See? No. I have. I have no. six degrees of separation. No. Of this. No. <laughs> no. It's true. He decided that the arrow thing was too boring. Even though they all are dead anyway, he decided they're really alive and they have shinigami like powers. No, that's that's just out of nowhere. Like no one's brought this up that Quincy's can do things other than arrows. If so, if that's always been the case, if that's what happened during the Quincy Shinigami War, then Uryu is a failure. <laughs> well, <laughs> he's a complete failure. His dad if, basically said that though. Yeah, but his dad only do the arrow thing too, as far as we know. Maybe his dad's one of the Quincy's that are. I don't no no. It, it, first of all, first of all, if his dad is as powerful as he's done the Quincy's. When all this crap is going on on Earth, here's an idea: help. Well, why would you do that? You may hate the Shinigami, but you love the Earth where you live. You would think so. No, no, no. I know, I know. He loves it. He likes living. That's a that's actually in, ingrained in your body. You love to live. I mean, Goku loves the Earth, but he lets it get blown. Goku doesn't love anything. He's a terrible person. <laughs> he loves <laughs> fighting. <laughs> Goku, Goku lets the planet get destroyed like like every week. Well, because when you have magical balls that can bring things back, yeah. Oh. Yeah. Point is, we're not happy with Naruto. We're not happy with Bleach. Haven't been happy with Bleach for no, really like, long for like time. years. Really, for years. And Naruto basically... Actually, Naruto and Bleach both, I, I'm reading them now just so I can see the end of the story. Yeah. Full bring was a really big missed opportunity. They had a chance to give Ichigo new powers outside of giant generic anime sword slinging energy blast, which everyone has, where you swing the sword and energy comes out. I don't know if it started with Inuyasha, but it sure as heck got more popular with him. <laughs> yeah, and also, like, his outfit was cooler. It was cool. But, come on now. Everyone knows Katsuka Tencho is just, uh... It's just the wind scar, which I'm sure is something else from some of the other anime that came earlier. But the wind scar is cooler. It is cooler. And wind, wind scar sounds cool. First of all, his sword, unlike Ichigo's, actually had like five abilities that were varied and had different uses. Yeah, shoot diamonds. Congo Soha. That's Adam Barrage. That's the diamond thing. That's yeah, that, yeah, from I'm, Japanese I'm, I'm fans out that. there. I don't know if you knew that. I was just I'm just checking. <laughs> Nados and Getsuha, which is like, let me just open a portal to hell in your body. You cool with that? Oh, you're not. Doesn't matter. You're in hell now. I mean. <laughs> But Ichigo sword is, and, and I guarantee you, his is his, the, the long because yeah he's that the long sword and the short sword now. Yeah. The long sword is Shujutsu Tenshos. The short one will have some sort of defensive ability, and then he can, he'll combine them both to make like a bow and arrow thing, you know, to remember his mother by. And then that's gonna have the power. Is. Yeah, and then like I think the hollow is probably gonna be gone because that died off when he lost his powers or something. And then he won't go crazy, which was the, the fun of Bleach was waiting for him to snap and go crazy again. <laughs> um, and then he'll just still have the compressed thing. That is terrible. Because you it, know what's going to happen. They yeah. have a chance to make him have a real Bankai, which is always something huge and big and expressive of your soul. 
the full release. Nope, they'll be like, you're the same guy, but we're to add one power on top. First of all, how does the dude with one power beat Aizen? He has one power. But, or, it's, but it's a it's cool power. He's fast. I run fast and can shoot energy beams. And not beams, beam singular. He's really fast. Yamamoto can bring back the dead. Not anymore, because he's stupid. But he could have done that. <laughs> he could bring back the dead. He could He could create flame. He, well, he erases people. It's so hot. It's just like, it, it doesn't cut. It's just, I decided you were done. You don't tell me that wouldn't have worked. No, no, no. Let's use the final get to attention, which is a stupid name. And how does everyone, how does other people know? It, how does that, how that move pass down? Anyways, that's. That doesn't make any sense because everyone's soul is unique and it shouldn't be passed down in the same exact way. Anyways, though, so why everybody would you do? Knows it's there too. I mean, like, just, like no one is surprised. It's the like, final like, like, every, every time he walks up, they're like, "Are you going to use a get to get to get to the show? I mean, yeah, yeah. yeah that's stupid. Like, I've been waiting. And for then this. he just stood there like, "Oh no!" But any, <laughs> I, mean, I can tell, I can dang near tell but no, I got hit with this giant obvious beam that's going in a straight line. Anyways, though, so. Let's let let's let our most valuable Soul Reaper, who we all know has everything and is powerful and from all sources, let's let him give up his powers forever and be useless for like a like a year. Rather than hey, head captain, you're the strongest guy ever since like forever because you started everything. Why don't you just walk over there and then like just like cut his head off? We know it's gonna regen, but by the time it does, we'll put him in the prison cell thing, which is all they do with Ichigo. He cut him in half, and while he's regenerating. They did the thing. Yeah. Because they, they've acknowledged you can't kill Aizen. You just can't. But you can lock him away forever. And I understand that, what's his name, Malanto was under the illusion thing or whatever. But once they figured out that all you had to do was touch the blade, all, you, all Ichigo should have did was Chunpo, find the captain, pick up his old butt, come go back up. Because apparently, you remember when he was like, walk up to Aizen, he's like, I can walk up to you anytime I want. Like, remember that? Yeah. Where he's like, yeah, dude, I'm just, I'm just going to chill right here in your face. You cool with that? Not, oh, whatever, hand the face. Yeah. Like, <laughs> Yeah, while well, Aizen was talking ahead. Was, yeah, he was like, like yeah. by the way, that, that was actually the best scene in Bleach. Where really he was like, I blah, 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 boom. Like, <laughs> like, I am better than you and there's no way you can, uh, the look at, I can't do this. I was like, he just put his hand on his face? <laughs> and then like, then like, he just kept embarrassing him. And he's like, like, dude, he beat him so bad, the Hogyo Q was like, I don't believe in you anymore, dude. <laughs> Like, I don't have a soul, but I'm just going to say you lost this one. But anyway, he could have he just gone and made him touch the, the sword, and then he would have been fine. And then, how did the fight? He, he gave up doing the illusions. You going to tell me no one else could jump in on that fight? No one? No, no. Let's let Ichigo give his powers up. Yeah. That's, and if they gave his powers up, that should have been the end of Bleach. No. Yeah. No. <laughs> I mean, because... Cause, no, that, that, that. But we wouldn't get this riveting Quincy. Battle. Yes, exactly. <laughs> this, yeah, exactly. <laughs> it would have saved what little dignity they had left. He would have gone out on a high note. That was that was like a really good fight. It really was, except except but for the end. It was such a bad idea. Like his own soul was like, dude, we really don't want you to have this move because this is a stupid. First of all, why does the move give up your powers and exchange? like? That's that's a stupid thing. Why'd you do that? And how do you know? How do you know it's, it's going to do that? I don't know. Gold kryptonite takes away Kryptonian powers forever. But they don't know that. But they don't know. They that don't know that. There's no it's one. Never there's no one to never happen. happen to. It's never happened. Yeah. So I don't know. It just it just does. Sure, that, that, y'all okay. gotta y'all gotta step it up. Y'all gotta step. I mean, I they really don't because both of these these our series are going out. Yeah. I don't, I don't know if One Piece has the same problems. It probably doesn't. That's probably why people like it because it's like, it's like we don't really like it better. It just has less problems. Because I haven't seen these issues with One Piece, and I'm like I'm semi current. I haven't seen these glaring flaws. Have you noticed that, that, that lately they've been doing Dragon Ball one shots? No, because um after Dragon Ball Z ended, I decided that I was done with Dragon Ball. They keep doing these Dragon Ball one shots. They're they're terrible. I mean, they're just they're just well, are are they from Dragon Ball? Yeah. Are they after Z? Yeah. And th yeah, there that's that's the problem. <laughs> um so yeah, we, we're not happy with the state of shonen mangas Naruto and Bleach right now. 
Bernard, yeah. which is not. I, I actually I'm forgot it came out today. He had to remind me. I didn't read it until like earlier. I'm, I'm still actually not really happy with Titan right now either. Come to think of it, you know the only thing I'm actually happy with right now? Arrow. Magi. Magi is that's that's the stuff right there. <laughs> if you if you've ever seen our comic book Cares Are Us, which I know you have, I'm just name dropping you know, for that. Our artist is also really good at drawing characters from Magi. I saw one of her, her drawings of Ren Cohen, and I'm like, dang, guy who draws Maggie, you suck. <laughs> <laughs> but no, it's I like it. And like, are you reading the manga right now? I just started. Oh, okay, if you're reading the manga right now, like, I'm so sad at what's happening. I mean, it's also kind of happy because they're getting over it. But I, I, I don't want to. I can't. I can't even explain what I'm talking about because you're ready yet. You ruined everything, Walter. This is, not, this is why we can't have nice things. Yeah, yeah but, but I, I was the one who told you to read it. But then I surpassed it. you. This is true. You the did. The student you did. has become the master. <laughs> and it only took me like one, no, it took like a week. I couldn't sit down and watch the whole thing because I had stuff to do. I got a full-time job. But it's such a tight. It's such a tight. It's so good. It it's great. so good. It's it great. And then like, it's funny and there's fights and the chicks are hot and there's fights and like, I care about the political strife that's going on. And Aladdin keeps putting his face on women's chest, which is hilarious. But then, like, he gets, <laughs> he gets like rejected, and then oh no, Aladdin! Aladdin is the is, he's, he's the monkey. Yeah, he's the pimp. Uh, Aladdin is fine. Yeah, like, Alibaba. He only got slapped one time. Yeah, but even he, he wasn't even phased. Like that, that, that was by his magic teacher, right? Yeah, the, the, the blue hair chip, yeah. who was kind of hot too. Yeah, I mean, dude, like, like, look at what you're wearing. What did you expect to happen? <laughs> like, come on. You're Ali Baba, on the other hand, only gets that gets play from that one very humongous chick. Right. And 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 uh, what's her name? Um, who who's in love with it? Oh, Morgiana. Morgiana. Oh yeah. yeah. If you read the manga, they addressed the Ali Baba Morgiana issue and a few other things. In fact, a few other girls. Um, I felt so like it was it was like I can't I I, I can't spoil you because you don't want to be spoiled, right? No. I was so sad for him. Like it was like. But there was no fighting in that chapter. It was the worst chapter to read as a man. Because, ev- like, where he was, every guy has been at one point oh, in his that, life. That bad, huh? It was, you were that just bad, like... Huh? Oh, goodness. He was around, like... Do, do you care about other characters? No. Okay. Like, other characters were, 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 were getting girls. Like, hot girls that he, like, really shouldn't be pulling. Girls that knew Alibaba first, liked Alibaba first, and with him, meet somebody else for, like, five seconds. Like, hey, we're dating now. All around him. And he's just like... <laughs> I don't want to work anymore. I, I'm done. It's like you're three feet tall. She's hot. How? Did, what is going on here? You were a child when I met you. It just, it's like, like, have you? Are you uh, kept on the on the anime? Yeah. No. 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 Um. Only in the English language. Really. Have you seen the, the the pirate one? I've seen part of it. With like the the kid with like the hook hand. No. Oh. Uh, yep. No. I haven't seen the kid with the hand. Like with the braids, with the bubbles, and Dude, I just got I just got out of um, the 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 second dungeon that they beat in the in the. Uh... So you haven't seen Alibaba go train with people? No, they they were training, and then they went to the dungeon. Who's he training with? He was training with that guy, the sword master guy. Was that girl with him too? Yeah, the with like the kind of like the, the, the braid kind of thing with the no no the the the, the, the chick who was uh, with Aladdin or uh, Alibaba. No. Oh, okay. Never mind. Please, it don't make it make no sense what what was happening, and I was I was it, it hurt my soul. And then like Ali Baba made like one last plea to a character who I will not name for your benefit, and then character was all like, "We'll see." Which as a guy, you're like, "Oh, my world is over." <laughs> She said, "We'll see." I'm a I'm a prince and who can fly and makes fire out of nothing. And you said, "We'll see." I have nothing else to give you. <laughs> Just, that's that was my best shot. And you said, "We'll see." Yeah. Meanwhile, Aladdin's like, "You, let's go." Like, I'm just gonna put my face here, and you're gonna do whatever. And they're like, "Cool, yeah, yeah, yeah." yeah. He's he's like nine. <laughs> he doesn't even actually even want it, and he's just getting it. And I, and I was like, "Can I, can I hop in there real quick? Can we like tag team with him? I don't know." Yeah, like uh, Aladdin looks young enough that he's actually just looking for lunch. He's not really trying to do anything else, you know. But yeah, it's so sad. But it's such a great. It's, a, it's such, you, it's you, such you, a great. You need anime. to read the manga, dude, because you're you're finding out the origins of stuff and things. 
I'm gonna and, uh, yeah. I'm, I'm really, or, or at least catch up to the anime because like the 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 royal family kids of the of um, the co empire yeah. are just like powerful as crap for no reason. Just like I, I understand why they're taking over the world right now. Like because there's like they're like, can you stop us? Have you seen one of our children? Look at them. Like they're just amazing. And but, but for some reason, Sinbad can stop all of them single-handedly. I, that doesn't make any sense. Be, well, he's he's bomb like that. Yeah, he is. Yeah. Apparently, he's he's probably he's probably like the king of the Kool-Aid. He's probably. Empire. I think he, I think he's got like. Uh, have you seen Alibaba get dark chakra? I'm calling it chakra. I'm not well, calling he, it that he, I, Well, he got infected with it. Yeah. With it, yeah. So apparently, like I, I I think Sinbad has both light and dark, like Alibaba, uh, which is why he's trying to recruit Alibaba, and I think that's why he's. So different, but like, remember back when like they're like, oh, your magoi is running out because humans only have a small amount, basically. Uh-huh. Unless you're a magician, yeah, they're just like, Shh. yeah, forget that. <laughs> Whatever, just <laughs> fight until we think about it, and then you'll just replenish it somehow. <laughs> oh man. So yeah, Maggie's good. The other two things that the video is actually about, so so don't read those. Go read Maggie. <laughs> your life will be better for it. We should probably just start reviewing Maggie. We really should. Yeah. Uh, I don't well, know why I mean, we even... Let me, let, me, let me get caught up on it first. Yeah, I don't know why we even read Naruto anymore. <laughs> just, <laughs> it's just a big, big letdown. Well, I, I'm so glad we don't pay for it. Because <laughs> I'd be pissed. <laughs> no, I do have Shonen Jump, though. I, I want to see the end. Just write better. That's all I'm asking. Write better. No, Can't... it's... I, I haven't seen the anime in years, dude. I was watching it last week. Why? I don't know. Huh? I, mean, I was trying to figure that out as I was watching it, but like, it, it was the the, ed- the episode I was watching was actually a good episode. No, it wasn't because it's about Naruto. Like I have it on my Crunchyroll queue. I just don't watch it. I have it there just because like I'm like one day. I might. I'm well, there's three hundred and forty something episodes. I mean, it's, it's like, just all garbage now. Yeah, the the fillers are terrible. I mean, just oh god, they're just awful. I mean, I was wa- I'm watching as like. Um, Naruto is on his trip to see Killer B. I understand that the the manga was going too slow, so you had to do a fillers. Don't understand half of what's happening. Maggie doesn't have that problem. No, oh, because even when it goes outside of the outside of the it's, manga, it's good. still good. And I and I, I believe the manga or the, the anime is catching up to the manga right now, from what it seems. And you know what's happening? Nothing. They're just like you know what. When we're out of manga, we're just gonna stop and wait for the manga, and then we'll start up again. We're not gonna fill the space with nothingness and terrible. That make you hate the series, or I don't know, finish it and then realize that you did absolutely the wrong thing. Full Alchemist. <sighs> Although I do, I, I like Brotherhood. Well, yeah, it's, it's, I, I liked the first one too until I found out it was wrong, and then I hated it. <laughs> like I was so against Brotherhood when I first found out about it and then I read the manga I'm like oh no 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 they're right yeah, they're right yeah. this, this is the right call basically they, they made money on FMA twice that was smart and it's funny because <laughs> like I was watching Brotherhood and like the first time I watched Brotherhood I started realizing I was like this seems like I'm watching the same thing but it's not the same episode and episode 20-ish yeah and it's like completely different but yeah it was oh, worth it also watch Kuroko's Basketball. Love that show so much. The opening and this song Princess Tennis. are so. First of all, first of all, it's wrong. You're wrong. <laughs> You're wrong for that. <laughs> that's why we can't get nowhere as a people. That's my it's life. So no, no, that's my line. I stole it fair and square on the internet. Anyways, it, it's a good show. You should watch it. Just basketball. A couple shots, shots of black guys in there every now and then. The music is good. The opening and ending, from what I've heard, are actually sung by the voice actor of the main character. She's pretty talented. Says she? He, he, which is pretty talented. Oh, Not okay. Not she's the guy. I mean, because, you know, you can never tell. You really can't. Not in Japan. No one knows who anyone is until, like, they get to the bed. Like, oh, you're a dude? What? Yeah, and then, <laughs> and then, or, then, or then you go to a panel and you're like, I want to see the dude who voices, oh, it's a chick. Yeah, Naruto's a girl. In both languages, English and Japanese, probably German too. In, fact, in every language, is probably a girl. That would explain a lot, actually. <laughs> Saki's always a guy. I'm just, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. That would really explain a lot. Yeah. 
and soccer is probably a man. A grown man is like in like in like his fifties with a big forehead who lives like in a trailer somewhere. <laughs> like, oh my god, it's soccer. <laughs> no, anyways. Um, oh, but man. yeah, so um, we're getting ready for for WonderCon, which is in a couple weeks. Uh, may not be a video uh, two weeks from now. Um, we'll definitely do a video by Captain America, the Winter Soldier. Yeah, we're, yeah. we're going to see that tomorrow. Tomorrow night. Um, so yeah, that, there'll, there'll be a video for that. Um, if you want to support us, which obviously you do, because look at us, uh, go to booster.com slash offshoot comics. It's a fundraiser we're doing. It's kind of like Kickstarter, except you get a, uh, a t-shirt with it. Um, obviously, it, you know, the, the base donation is like $20, $20 with $5 shipping, but you get a cool t-shirt, uh, with a, uh, sort of collage of all of our characters, um, done by one of our artists. And uh, it supports us, uh, helps us go to cons, um, keep doing this, uh, pay our artists, you know, all things that we need to keep Do doing. to be, you know, here a successful business. Present. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So if you like our videos, if you like us, help us out, make our lives a little easier, and uh, buy one of the shirts. Um, or, you know, if you can't afford to buy it, like and share it and favorite and all that stuff, get it out there. But we only need 50 shirts to meet our first goal. Um, so please help us. Please love us. Follow us on Twitter at Offshoot Comics. That's that's correct, right? That's how you say it, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah that's at, at Offshoot Comics. Yeah. Yeah. We're not. We're, I'm not Twitter. You but actually, you, you actually could also follow just me at, at no, um, Walter no, no. B. Love. No, just follow Offshoot Comics. We can't be diver- we can't divert them. No, no, no. Because when you follow me, you'll be following Offshoot Comics because I I. I Frequently now mention Audrey Comics. Notice I said now. Now, yeah, now you did before because what th- this is what had happened. No, you're a traitor. What, you're a traitor. What, what what had happened was I started noticing that people who matter started following me on 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 Twitter, mm-hmm. and that has to do with the fact that people are following us on Audrey Comics. People who matter like you people. Exactly. So I started realizing that maybe I should you know mention things. Yeah. And stuff. So yeah, follow Audrey Comics. Uh, look through our followers, you'll be able to find him. Um, I don't have a Twitter. He should have a Twitter. I, I operate the Offshoot Comics Twitter. That's enough Twitter for me. In fact, it's actually Twitter. too much Twitter for me. <laughs> yeah, Twitter actually is a weird is a weird entity. I, I'm not gonna get it's into like it. It's like a job. It's, it's, yeah, it's like and I have two of those already. I can't I can't do. And that's not even counting Offshoot Comics. That's I it's like four. It's like adding a fourth job. I don't want to do it. Facebook is enough. Twitter was pushing it. We have oh yeah we have a Tumblr. Which is just, I think it's like Tumblr dot offshoot comics. We have that. That's up. I'm I'm doing that too. Uh, we should actually probably put up some pictures on our uh, Tumblr. No. Instagram. Yeah. No. Twitter. No. Facebook. No. YouTube. No. That other thing. Our know, website. We're, we're no. Yeah, you know, the other thing where we put pictures up. Uh, I think I ran through uh, Pinterest. No. <laughs> Reddit? No. <laughs> in case, in case you're wondering what, what I'm doing here, uh, we have a lot of, of media know. exposure, and so you know, if if you want to, you can follow us on pretty much anything you just heard him mention. Um, we're there. Am, am I still thinking of something? Yeah. Is is, is, there, is there really something to think about? Yeah. Just what is it? I don't know. I can't remember that. You, oh, you said that. <laughs> Oh, oh! I'm so upset. Um. <laughs> anyways, <laughs> uh, yeah, that's that's the episode for this week. Uh, yeah, like us, favorite, all that jazz. Remember, booster.com slash offshoot comics. Um, yeah, and then follow us on DeviantArt. Yeah, it's oh, DeviantArt. I was I was thinking that, but I know if you knew that was because that's kind of hip and like in the scene, and I know if you were. You used the word hip. Hey, 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 son. Hey, son. All right? I'm a cool cat. <laughs> On that note. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're on DVR. Um, until next time, we've been your host, Kirby Kid. And Black Superman. See you later, guys. Hey, guys, don't forget to like, favorite, subscribe, and share our videos like crazy. That's right, because we love you, we want you to love us, and we want to keep making videos for you. And keep leaving us comments. We love comments. Yes, and we answer comments. Unlike some of the other guys, we'll get out there, we'll answer, and if you uh, have a great comment, we'll make a video about it. And if you have a not-so-great comment, we will try to address that issue. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, thanks. Till next time, we'll be your host, Kirby Kid. And Black Superman. See you later, guys. 
Ah, you can't record. Oh, you said hip. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm down with it. 